At any given time, somewhere on earth, people are gathering to share food in the name of God. This food is spiritual nourishment meant to bring us closer to each other and closer to our Creator. It brings the community together with a sense of shared identity and purpose. This is the story of the Holy Kitchens. Join Vikas Khanna as he visits the birthplace of the Sikh religion in India. On this journey, we will share the wonderful tradition of the communal kitchen known as the Langar. The story of Sikhism begins with Guru Nanak Dev Ji in the 15th century. The legend tells of a young man given 20 rupees by his father who then sent him out into the world to make his fortune. But this divinely inspired young man was so moved by the sight of so many hungry people that he used all of the money to feed them. When asked by his father what he had done with the money, he is said to have replied, I have done the such a sada, or the true business. And this is really at the heart and soul of Sikhism, that a man cannot think about his relationship with God if he is hungry. And it is our true business to see that our fellow man is taken care of. That is a powerful sense of responsibility, and it has created a warm and supportive sense of community, as you will see. The heart and soul of Sikhism is the Golden Temple in Amritsar, and that is where we shall see our first langar. This is the home of the Sri Guru Granth Sahib Ji, the holiest literature in the Sikh religion. The temple was built in the 16th century, and every day the langar at the Golden Temple feeds thousands upon thousands of people. For many of those who come to eat, the langar is the only thing between them and death by starvation. And here is what is unique about the Sikh langar. Everyone is welcome to come and eat, regardless of race or creed. There is no hierarchy as people come in and sit side by side on the floor. It is a statement that all men may not be equal outside the temple in terms of status, but they are all the same in the eyes of God. This notion of equality extends to the procuring, preparation, and serving of the meals. All adherents of Sikhism are required to take their turn, and this has a remarkable effect on their feeling of community.